pals, welcome to my channel. My name is Kat and I do Disney related content every week. And today I have for you a Disney ABC challenge. The fantastic Christy from Christy's Corner came up with this challenge and I will link below all the amazing other Disney YouTubers that are involved. I decided to do a little bit of a twist on this and I chose female Disney characters that are a little underrated and don't get as much love. So let's get started. A, Abby Mallard from Chicken Little. She is hilarious. She is the best friend, but she also has beauty inside and she is voiced by the amazing Joan Cusack, who also does Jessie from Toy Story. B, Blue Fairy from Pinocchio. Poor Blue Fairy, she doesn't get enough love. I mean, she set the story in motion. C, Captain Amelia from Treasure Planet. She is voiced by Emma Thompson, and she is absolutely one of my favorite characters in one of my favorite movies. She is strong, eloquent, and she's a cat. I mean, she's pretty kick butt. <laughs> D, Dinah the cat from Alice in Wonderland. I love cats, but I love Dinah because she doesn't get enough love. She's so cute and she's only in the story for a small amount of time. But I mean, she's a cat. <laughs> e, a, Eudora from Princess and the Frog. That is the mother of Tiana and she is voiced by Oprah Winfrey. I love the relationship between Tiana and her mother. It's just so sweet and she definitely does not get enough love. Speaking of another mother who doesn't get um, her comeuppance is Franny Robinson from Meet the Robinsons. Hilarious movie and Franny teaches frogs how to sing and dance. I mean, that's <laughs> pretty fantastic. G. Grandma Fa from Mulan. She is hilarious. I mean, she takes a cricket and walks through a crowded street. <laughs> and then she's like, you, you. <laughs> yep, it's a lucky bug. <laughs> she has some great lines and I just adore her. And she reminds me of my grandma. <laughs> H, Honey Lemon from Big Hero 6. She might be as sweet as her name, but she definitely has major backbone and is just a fearless fighter and hero. I adore her. Plus she has like amazing outfit. I, Inuko from Brother Bear 2, voiced by Wanda Sykes. I love Brother Bear and I love Brother Bear 2. She has a smaller role. She's the shaman, but she's a very important role. I love the intricate story of Brother Bear and just it's profound in a lot of ways and you guys should watch both of them. Jay, Jane Porter from Tarzan. I feel like poor Jane definitely is the least um, talked about princess or princess like. I mean, hello, she flew across um, the jungle in heels, mind you, and a beautiful bonnet and hat. I mean, um, dress. It, she's amazing. She's an explorer. Uh, Jane needs more love. <laughs> K. Kidda. Princess Kidda, or Kidda Gush. I cannot pronounce that. <laughs> From Atlanta's The Lost Empire. Another one of my favorite, favorite movies. She is all about saving her, her, uh, saving Atlantis, um, protecting her people, and she's just so lovely, and I just love her outfit, and it's such a great story. L, Lady Tremaine. I had to get some baddies on there. Lady Tremaine from Cinderella is also known as the wicked stepmother, or yeah, <laughs> the evil stepmother. <laughs> she is forced to be reckoned with. She will do everything and anything to get her daughters ahead of everybody else, uh, no matter the cost. Another baddie is M, Madam Mim from Sword in the Stone. She is hilarious. She's a baddie, but she like likes to have fun. You know, she's kind of more mischievous. She's I think of her more of like a Loki than like a true villain. <laughs> N, Nanny 
Pelica from Lilo and Stitch. Poor Nanny. I mean, she's raising her sister on her own, trying to keep a job with a crazy dog thing and then, you know, balance her love life a little bit. Nanny needs some love. <laughs> oh, this one was a little hard. I couldn't really find an O name that I really connected with. Um, I, but I did look this up and it said it's either a girl or boy. So I'm going with Orange Bird. <laughs> Orange Bird is basically the mascot for Florida. So I'm going with that. Another one that isn't a Disney princess or Disney related is Odette from The Princess Swan. And I just really wish that they would remake that through Disney. <laughs> P, Princess, I'm not going to say this right, Eloni, Eloni. I haven't seen The Black Cauldron in many years, but I remember I used to really like her character. Um, it's such an interesting story because it was during that time of uh, Disney movies. It was a little bit darker. You had like, um, you you had the rescuers down under and stuff like that. So it's, it's definitely one that I feel needs to be remade. And maybe um, Princess Eloi can get a her uh, a new remake. Disney do that. Q, Queen Nasseria. That is Susan Sarandon from Enchanted. I love Enchanted. It is absolutely one of my favorite movies. And again, like kids now don't really watch it and moms make your kids watch it. It's amazing. Um, she is like the living evil queen like how 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 i picture a baddie she just portrayed that perfectly um r we have rita from oliver and company rita is a bad butt she she just owns the streets and she knows how to take care of herself and others um s shank from ralph breaks internet if you haven't seen ralph breaks internet go see it um, I think it's on Netflix. It is really, it's not my favorite sequel, but I really like her character. I like that Penelope is able to have this role model of a woman who's kind of like how she wants to be, kind of how she is. And it's just, it's portrayed really well. T, Turk from Tarzan, voiced by Rosie O'Donnell. Turk is mischievous hilarious and best friend hello you uma from descendants 2 and descendants 3 i really love descendants because my niece loves it so we had we really get to spend time together watching the movies um and uma's pretty awesome v vanessa from the little mermaid so i feel like vanessa is like her is ursula's like inner goddess <laughs> like 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 that's how she like really is <laughs> w widow widow tweed from fox and the hound oh fox and the hound and widow she protects oh my gosh she protects the animals and she's so kind and she you know she took in um the fox and the wardrobe from Beauty and the Beast is another one who doesn't get a lot, a lot of love. Um, she has great lines and she's a diva who loves to sing. So love her. X was almost impossible. So I went through all the universes that I could think of and came up with X-23 from X-Men Comics. I'll just leave it at that. <laughs> Why? my personal favorite i got a little purple going on um in honor of her that is yizma from ember's new groove yizma is hashtag villain goals she is just relentless she is hilarious and she knows what she wants and she's not gonna stop <laughs> z um i love old Disney Channel movies. So I picked Xenon. <laughs> um, Xenon is one of those movies. There were 
three of them. So, you know, these are pretty popular. And if you're about my age or a little bit younger, you know what I'm talking about. She was a girl from another planet galaxy. And I mean, the songs were pretty epic. Well, thank you guys for joining me, and please check out all the other lists of A to Z. Have a great day. Bye, guys.